Hey everyone, Solar here. Welcome back to another Destiny video. Today, I'm going to be talking to you guys about how to get the Year 3 Thorn quest. Now, personally, I don't have it. That's why you're seeing gameplay of just like a strike in the background. This is old gameplay, not Rise of Iron stuff. Uh, but I, pardon the um, lack of videos that will probably be coming up. School's hectic. I've just been grinding Rise of Iron out, so that's why there might not be any content, even though this is like the best possible time I could put content out for Rise of Iron. So let's get straight into this quest. Uh, first off, a little bit of nostalgia. You're going to have to get the Thorn quest uh, like you used to in year one by turning in Vanguard Crucible bounties. Uh, it will become a random drop as like how you used to get it, an exotic drop just from turning a bounty in. Uh, most people that have gotten it, it has been from the Shiro 4 bounties, where you have to complete Archon's Forge missions and just do different patrols and stuff for the Vanguard. So, uh, pretty low-ish drop rate from those bounties. Uh, you can get them over the next couple of weeks. But let's get into the first steps. So step one is called Echoes of Darkness. You have to face the Wretched Eye and defeat Kovic, the Devil Splicer's High Priest. Uh, this works on the normal difficulty or hard difficulty. So if you're working on some of those record book stuff, uh, the hard difficulty might be better for you, but normal if you want to get it done faster. So basically you just have to complete the Wretched Eye Strike. Step 2, Harvest of the Lesser. You have to wipe out Fallen in the Plague Lands to feed the weapon's appetite. Uh, you have to kill about 500 Fallen uh, out in the Plague Lands. Step 3, Feast Upon the Light. You have to use Void Damage to defeat Guardians in the Crucible, so that's basically like year 1. So, like, uh, if you're Defender Titan, you may want to switch over to a Night Stalker or a Void Walker. Uh, void Walker with Void Weapons would probably be the best way to go for this one. Uh, cleansed by the Light. You have to consume Motes of Light to cleanse yourself and the weapon. So basically, consume X amount of Motes of Light, and you will be able to uh, charge up the weapon. And then the final step in this quest is called Where It Began. Find a Skeleton Key and open the Strike Horde at the end of the Abomination High Strike. So basically you have to play through the new Philgoth strike, and at the end, open up the chest, and you will get the final piece of the Thorn weapon. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick little informational video. Uh, if you liked it, stick around, um, subscribe. I'll have more Rise of Iron content out today and over the next couple of days, especially on the weekends. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.